Can you survive the temporary? On the other side of temporary pain, you get introduced to your other self. And that other self produces that other life. When challenges and issues come back to back to back, and it seems like something is after me, something is attacking my journey. You're thinking about quitting. You're thinking about giving up. You are caving in. Don't give up. Stay in it. Stay focused. Maybe you need to rename your storm. Yeah, it sucks. Yeah, it's hard. But somehow healing's coming out of this. It's easy to have faith and feel good when you're feeling good and you have no pain and your bills are paid. It's easy to be motivated then. But when that's not the situation, it's hard. But it's worth fighting. It's worth mustering yourself up, standing up inside yourself. It's worth being up tempo. It's worth fighting relentlessly, never giving up. There's going to be things that go on that are out of your control. The worst thing you can do is let something that's out of your control control you. Get control of yourself. Get control of your emotions. Don't get angry. Don't get frustrated. Instead, stay calm and figure out how to move forward. You know what I ask myself when going through pain? What if I can do it? What if I can defy all the odds? What if I can prove everyone wrong? What if I can pull off a fucking miracle? What if I can become someone that no one thinks I can be? And just the thought of that can give you the strength to pull yourself out of the gutter and back in the fight one more time. You got to go all the fucking when there's a will, there's a way, and there's always a way. When you're committed, you don't care about the facts. You don't care about the odds. You don't care about the opinions of others. The only thing you care about is making it through to the other fucking side. No matter what it takes, you just got to keep searching, keep fighting, keep hammering, keep failing, keep trying, keep getting back up again, and stop at nothing to reach it. I will never quit because if you quit, you're done. I will never quit. I will persevere and I will thrive on adversity. My team expects me to be physically harder and mentally stronger than our opponents. I will be physically harder and mentally stronger than anything that comes against me, my family, my business, my brothers, my sisters, my team. I will be the one that is physically harder and mentally stronger and I will work to maintain that position. You won't be, you have got to make a decision in your life. You have got to make a decision about your fitness. You have got to make decisions about your business. You have got to make decisions about your marriage. You have got to make decisions about your kids. Because you know what? Your only other option is to crouch in stagnant fear like a coward and potentially die and potentially put the lives of everyone who depends on you in jeopardy. And the reason that Chad Chad Wright is sitting here right now talking to you is because Chad Wright mustered whatever strength that he had left to claw his way back onto his freaking feet and pony up that no matter how many times I was knocked down, that I would muster enough strength to get back on my feet and get in the fight.